Now from Punjab, moving on to Uttar Pradesh. Yogi Adityanath is all set to be sworn as the UP Chief Minister again, which means for the second consecutive term, thereby creating history. India Today has accessed inside details of the oath-taking ceremony that is most likely to be held on 25th of March. Now the Bharatiya Janata Party is going to go all out to mark the day in grand celebration. Sources are telling India today that Yogi Cabinet 2.0 will be sworn in at the Atal Bihari Vajpayee Ekana Cricket Stadium in Lucknow City, which has a seating capacity of about 50,000 people. Every MLA will be accompanied by their family members, their supporters to the ceremony. There will also be a system of invitation card or an admit card, so to say, for all the visitors to be allowed entry, which will be made available at the district level prominent figures from the field of writing, literature, engineering, medicine, religious leaders, all of them will be invited to the ceremony. So there's going to be a long list that has been prepared for Yogi Adityanath's cabinet's mega swearing-in ceremony. Take a look at those visuals. Remember, that was Holi coming early for Yogi Adityanath. Holi manai ja rahi hai, Chitra. Holi manai ja rahi hai. In Gorakhpur, but of course, that was not the culmination. The culmination will be on the day when Yogi Cabinet is again announced. Abhishek Mishra and Lucknow joining with all the latest. Uh, Abhishek, who will be expected to be called? Beyond, of course, the Cabinet and their family members, expected big names from the Bharatiya Janata Party. Any names that you're picking up, do you think that for this big day, they will be invited? And how are we looking at the Yogi Adityanath 2.0 cabinet to return and in a grand celebration just in a short while. Well, absolutely. It's going to be a very grand affair as far as BJP is concerned. It is the first time in the 37 years when a government is repeating and CM Yogi Adityanath is all set to take that oath. What we are getting to know from the sources that the chief ministers of BJP rule states will be invited. They would be there along with Prime Minister Narendra Modi, who is the star of the show, who, ha who is a major reason behind the victory of the BJP of the 273 in Uttar Pradesh. Along with him, uh, there would be several uh, union ministers, uh, including Amit Shah, not saying, and all those top leaders will be there. But importantly, the leader from the opposition have also been invited, uh, including Akhilesh Yadav, Mayavati, and Mulayam Singh Yadav. So we can also expect them to be part of this grand ceremony. But other than that, 200 VVIP guests are uh, expected, uh, and a massive 45,000 capacity of the stadium is all set for this grand oath taking ceremony, which will be held in Atal Vihari Vajpayee Kana Stadium in Lucknow. So that is a very important day, and the BJP has already begun the preparations by from inviting the dignitaries uh, to the, you know the decorations to uh, a massive uh, you know uh, campaign as as far as, uh, you know, publicizing this event is concerned, is already happening. But uh, the BJP is giving a very important message through this uh, event that the government is repeating that too on the demand of the people and they have got the mandate. And Siam Adityanath was the face of the election campaign. And But on the 25th of March, when this oath ceremony will happen, this yes. will showcase the power of BJP in the state as well as in the center, how the double-injured government so have been working. end of the week then, the that means uh, will conclude and culminate with this mega ceremony for the Bharatiya Janata Party. And why not? Because the manner in which, the mandate with which they have managed to return creating history, Abhishek Mishra will be tracking all the latest on that. It remains to be seen who all will be invited for this ceremony.